Sorrow of Life by Shui Feng. Ancient people said there are three major sorrows in life, losing one's father in youth, losing one's wife in middle age, and losing one's child in old age. I don't entirely agree with this view for two reasons. First, it seems irrelevant to women, and second, these sorrows are not inherent but are caused by human cognition and culture. My view on the sorrows of life is as follows. One, the first sorrow, lack of maternal love in infancy. Two, the second sorrow, no playmates in childhood lacking ample playtime. Three, the third sorrow, no guidance on life knowledge in adolescence. Four, the fourth sorrow, lack of romance in youth, failing to establish faith, wasting time and energy on the material pursuits of marriage, family, food, clothing, housing, and transportation. Five, the fifth sorrow, major setbacks in middle age. Six, the sixth sorrow, being despised in old age. Seven, the seventh sorrow, learning the Bible in youth, studying Buddhist scriptures in youth, and studying the Quran in old age. Eight, the eighth sorrow, delving into practices, supernatural powers, and metaphysics. Among these eight sorrows, having any one of them means life is regrettable. Having two means life is grievous. Three, life is painful. Four, life is a failure. Five, life is chaotic. Six, life is hateful. Seven, life is suffering. Eight, life is hellish. I possess an unparalleled wonderful method. By following this method, all eight sorrows can be resolved. April 3rd, 2022.